My females are literally the prize. The man is really the prize. The woman is always the prize. Men have always been the prize. I hear some guys say, well, uh, I'm, we are the prize, the man is the prize. No such thing. So let's get the most controversial arguments on social media right now. The men are the prize, women are the prize, 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 prize thingy. Who exactly is the prize? You know, the gender war going on on social media now is really, really hilarious. And at the same time, it is total waste of time. And I really want to talk about the ideology behind the, the argument of women are the prize, men are the prize okay i feel like the argument started when i value relationship coaches like kevin samuels andrew tate and the likes started infusing and promoting toxic content to men thereby exposing them to the narrative that men are the prize they should stop being masculine they should not be a provider they should sit and expect the woman to do everything for them when you tell this man that you want to be treated this way they give you a reason why they can't treat you that way okay they give you reasons why they can't be masculine so i feel like that's where the argument started from now the whole purpose of this video is to dead that argument okay for women right from inception right from time have always been the price this is not an argument thingy or something it is a fact women have been the price right from time and i'm gonna prove to you today that women are the price you see women are the only creatures that are born with value the minute a woman is born she is already valuable on the other side men are not born with value a man cannot just wake up and say that okay i want to do nothing and still be sought after i want to be nothing and still be priced like they say now on social media men are not the price again it doesn't matter whether a woman is rich or pretty or i don't know what you want to call it as long as she's a girl she's valuable okay she's valuable in so many ways on the other side again a man has to be rich a man has to have money a man has to have substance to be respected among his peers. okay a man cannot just choose to not do anything you know if you're broke you don't have money as a man you cannot go into the society and act like you're the price or you are valuable you are not valuable i don't find men on inch when they ask women what do they bring to the table the question actually is supposed to be directed towards me because as a woman you have millions of things to bring to the table okay you have so many things to bring to the table that a man cannot even bring to the table you know we give birth we are the, we are the nurturers we take care of the home 99 percent of men do not cook and clean men are doing that the whole argument of what the women bring to the table and all that stuff if you're a woman and you're watching this if a man should ask you what do you bring to the table just know that that man does not see you valuable he does not see you as somebody of value nobody should ever ask a woman what does she bring to the table okay but i digress that is not the topic here today the only time a man feels that is the price or okay we, we we see a lot of situations and easy situations that happen on social media amongst women where they fight over a man or they they leave their job they leave their livelihood and they stop everything they are doing to live for a man you should know that this type of women are women that don't realize their value they don't know what they bring to the table they don't have self-love they don't see themselves as something good they cannot live that way so when this type of women get with men this further um proves to men that they are the price almost every second there is a conversation about men doing everything for men men gushing over men and all that stuff and i'm not saying women should not be interested in men or they should not gush over them but you should not centralize your life around a man centering your life from a man is very essential as a woman because your universe your life your achievement everything you are doing in this life should not only be about a man you know some women feel like a relationship marriage is an achievement you know once they have that relationship once they have a man they've achieved every single thing in this life marriage is 
this an achievement but that is not all you should aim for okay this type of situations prove to men that they are the prize but men are not the prize a man is not the prize men have always always been the prize and that should it and my last point here the thing is if you check very closely here why do men make money why do men work so hard you know why do they work so hard to like make money and all that stuff and if your man goes from being broke to rich tell me what it does in the first few um, times of being rich it goes after women okay when a man suddenly becomes rich it sorts after women especially women that he was not able to get when he was broke he goes after those women why because women are the price again if you check in closely the reason why men make money is for women because when they make this money they buy cars they buy jewelries they buy wristwatches and all those expensive things okay they try to flaunt and show off to their fellow men but in reality they actually get all these things to impress women to impress us okay men are not the price the fact that men are not the price does not um does not reduce them in any way it doesn't take the fact that they are also very important okay men are very important if we all are important to each other both men and women men not being the price does not take away from their masculinity it doesn't take anything from them actually you know it's just like us saying that women are the only creatures that can give birth and the men start the argument of it's a lie men also can give birth why are we starting that argument it's just a fact okay so this argument should not even be something that should be discussed on social media and i find people that engage in this kind of conversations i find them to be jobless i find them to be people that does not have something valuable to do with their time because because there are just some um, conversations that should not even be had at all okay if you think that men are still the price after this video let me know in the comment section let's discuss let's hear your opinion let's hear your reason for saying men are the price and if you agree with me that women are the price also let me know your thoughts in the comment section please subscribe to my channel i have some inspirational videos for you on this channel to watch if you're into self-development and the likes and i would see you guys in my next video